name is Florian Ocons. I'm a senior software engineer and I work in the technology industry. Uh, so I work on the Code for Life website, uh, which is a not-for-profit initiative as part of Ocado's Skills for the Future program. Uh, and we basically have two games on our website, um, free fun educational games for students to learn how to program. Um, so as a software engineer, I work on these two games, uh, maintain them, make sure they provide the, the um, educational tools that are needed for, for the teachers as well. Um, and um, I also work on the interface of the website. Um, and I have to make sure as well that the website is secure and safe. So I have a bachelor's degree in computer science. Um, I did a four year course. Uh, it was a, basically a three year course of computer science with the Indian industry. Um, and during this course, I also did some summer internships to gain some experience in computer science and programming. Um, my third year uh, was a one year internship, which I did in Ocado in the Code for Life team. Um, so the main reason I really enjoy my job is because of the impact that um, our product has in the world. Um, something else I really like is um, the fact that I get to puzzle solve every day. And um, something else that I really like is um, because we're such a small team, we get to work on lots of different things. Um, we wear lots of different hats, uh, which means that I get to learn all the time. So I would say attention to detail is very important. Um, because of the nature of programming as well. Um, it's, it can be quite, it can get down to like the smallest detail um, why something isn't working. And I would also say that collaboration uh, is very important. Another skill that's important to have is problem solving. Um, like I mentioned, every task that you work on is like a puzzle in itself. The first thing I would tell my younger self is um, not to worry about asking questions or asking for help. Um, I remember when I started as an intern in Code for Life, I was always really hesitant to ask questions and to ask for help uh, because I didn't want to make it seem like I didn't know what I was doing or I didn't want to make it seem like I wasn't understanding what my task was. Um, but I realized later on that um, that doesn't really matter. Something else that I would tell my younger self is not to worry about making mistakes. It's um, always a learning opportunity when you make a mistake. Um, another thing I would tell my younger self is to take more initiative. Um, for example, as soon as you have the opportunity to um, run a meeting for the first time or um, suggest ideas to the team about maybe new features you want to bring to the table or even just the direction that the team should be taking. So for me, Code for Life is about giving everyone the ability to get into tech. Um, it's about breaking down these barriers and preconceptions that come with getting into tech and um, tech in general. Um, and it's about showing people what is achievable with tech and the power that it has and, um, and inspiring the future generation to get into tech. I would say be curious and always try out new things because tech always changes. Um, I would say to be patient and to be persevering um, because tech, working in tech is can be frustrating uh, and it's fine if you don't understand something at first. Um, and finally, I would say to have fun with it um, because shaping new things is always fun.